On this episode, why you definitely, absolutely 100% need a vision for your business. If I walked into your business and grabbed the first person that I saw and asked them, what is the vision for this business? Would they know the answer? If I grabbed somebody from your management team and asked them that same question, would they know the answer? Do you even know the answer to that? What? The risk here is that if you haven't gone through the process of writing down what your vision is for your business, it's gonna be in your head. And the problem with that is it's gonna keep on changing and it's not gonna be clear and you're not gonna be able to communicate it effectively. Have you ever had a dream that you um, you had your... You your job as the leader of your business is to provide a direction. Point. And if you haven't written down what that direction looks like, I bet you are not clear enough and therefore your people will absolutely not be clear enough. And that doesn't help them make decisions. It doesn't help them get excited about how they can help you get to where you want it to be. Now, the other thing about this is that your team members aren't gonna be super excited about jumping out of bed to help you put two million pounds in the bank. They're not gonna get that excited about helping you achieve your 16.5% EBIT. That doesn't matter to them. Your team members want to feel like they are part of a business that is bigger than themselves, that has a really clear direction, something that is exciting and interesting. That's going to help your retention, it's going to help your engagement, and it's going to help you get people focused on the right things. My suggestion is that you investigate some form of methodology that's going to work for you. My recommendation is the Vivid Vision Framework. Check out this book, you can read it, it's got a cool framework. It's also got some advice on how to roll that framework out into your business. But you need something, you need an understanding of where you are going and why it is important. So give yourself that gift of clarity, give your team members that gift of clarity, or the risk is they might go and find it elsewhere. See you next time on Mind Your Own Business.